out-of-state investors. This property right here, it's a duplex. It features a full renovation, new mechanicals, and it's only $40,000. There's no way you can go wrong, is there? This is your show. This is the show where I work for you directly, taking your needs. I'm going through the MLS, and I'm trying to find the best possible deal for you guys. Put down 25%. That's the perfect way to buy this. That's why real estate investing is the greatest industry in the world. Everyone, welcome to another episode of the MLS Search Analysis Show. I am your host, James Wise. You're watching Holton Wise TV. This is the show where I work with real estate investors just like you guys, one-on-one, -on -one, no matter where you live, okay? My clients, a uh, couple of cats out of Oregon, uh, Ricky and Robbie, bros, all right? Now, we do a couple things on this show, right? You guys can give me your criteria, your wants, your needs, your goals, your budget, blah, 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 blah. By the way, to do that, send an email to sales at holtonwise.com. Give us your number. My team will walk you through the process so you can get some customized videos just like Ricky and Robbie are getting, okay? So you can give me all your info, and I'll scour the MLS here in the Cleveland market, right? We got 5,000 realtors out here. There's a lot of deals uh, taking place on the MLS, and most of those real estate agents don't know anything about working with investors, right? That's where I come in. I work for you, you alone. Right, that's one uh, part of what we do on the show. The other part is you guys could send me deals uh, that you are interested in, and I'll give you my unbiased take. Right, they don't all have to be on the MLS. Okay, you can be sent uh, wholesale deals. You could do direct mail. Right, I got the sponsor of our show here, PropStream. Right, you guys could uh, you know click the show notes below. Build yourself a mailing list and uh, direct market to motivated sellers all you want. Get those off-market deals however you want. Then you can bring me the deal, and I'll give you my unbiased take, right? So that's kind of what we have going on here. This particular property, it's this one right here, right? Got a couple nice duplexes next to it, okay? This is an off-market deal, so it's going to look a little different than what the show normally does. All we got is this Craigslist listing, right? For sale by owner. Uh, Ricky and Robbie, you guys talk to this guy, and you're like, James, we're interested in this deal. Man, what are your thoughts? So that's what I'm going to do. The address, uh, it is 9612 Mount, uh, uh, Mount Auburn, Cleveland, 44104. Again, it's a little different looking than what you guys are used to seeing on the show. There's no fancy MLS listing, right? All we have is this Craigslist listing right here. And as far as the property goes, you know, it's pretty decent, right? They did the, the reno. Uh, you know, things are looking pretty nice. Let me pull this bad boy up. Okay, there we go. Big screen for you guys. All right, so just a solid classic Cleveland duplex, normal layout. You got uh, living room in the front, dining room in the middle, kitchen in the back. On the side, you got two beds with a bathroom in the middle. You know, solid stuff. And they did a pretty decent looking reno here, right? I like the cabinetry. I like the countertop. Home Depot, Lowe's quality, nice little tile floor action. All right, looks like... Uh, they did most of the rehab. They didn't finish it. There's actually a note in the Craigslist thing, and I'll read that in a second. But they did get a lot of it done. You got two brand-new furnaces, brand-new updated electrical, new plumbing. Everything is looking pretty good except for what they didn't finish, right? You got to finish up the other unit. But the price is freaking cheap, man. It is only forty thousand dollars this is what they had to say two family house two car garage two uh bedroom each partially rehab new kitchen floors new bathroom floors new exterior doors new ceiling fans and light fixtures updated electric panels all new updated plumbing double washer and dryer hookup two newly installed 93 percent high efficiency high efficiency furnace just did that in january one new hot water tank rehab stop due to personal reasons must sell best offer accepted and he's asking for 40 G's for this thing, right? So, Robbie and Ricky, you guys are looking at this like, man, 40 G's, dude, you can't go wrong, can you? As a matter of fact, you can, okay? You can go wrong. Is this a good deal? I don't know. Probably not. Uh, it could be a good deal for certain people, not you two. This ain't going to work for you guys, okay? You need to be somebody who's local, uh, who could handle the property management themselves and take care of this, right? It's not going to work for two out-of-state investors that are trying to build their portfolio in Cleveland. You guys don't have any uh, experience in the Cleveland market, do you, nor do you have, like, your own team, right? You have my team, yes, okay, the Holton Wise team. But Holton Wise, legitimate uh, licensed contractor, one of the largest property management companies in the area, okay? Now, what Holton Wise and other 
general contractors and large property management companies have in common is we will not work neighborhoods that are this dangerous, this rough, this tough. Okay, it is just not worth it. I cannot staff my company if I'm sending them to neighborhoods like this, right? This neighborhood is one of the worst neighborhoods in the city of Cleveland. As far as like what the metrics would go, like what the numbers would look like, uh, as far as your gross rents and anticipated costs, I got no freaking clue. Okay, I can't project that out for you because these properties are too inconsistent uh, to provide you guys that because the neighborhood is so blighted, you can't hire a legitimate company like Holton Wise. We just, the answer is no, we just won't manage it for you, right? So you're stuck then having to scramble and usually hire uh, property managers just getting started or illegal unlicensed property managers. So you got the difficulty of the neighborhood working against you and you got the fact that you can't really hire a reasonable labor force to work for you right because i can't hire a reasonable labor force to work for me if i'm sending them to super dangerous neighborhoods right and there's a lot of clues if you're just looking on google earth which is what i have here like if you look at the first spot like yeah this looks like just your normal like cd grade cleveland neighborhood right this is your property you got a couple nice duplexes right next to it just like normal low-income stuff but all you got to do is just a little bit of research, just cruise down the street, and then the picture starts to get painted for you how blighted this is, right? Right here, this used to be a house, no longer a house, right? Just torn down. Neighborhood so blighted, didn't make sense uh, to build another one. Here's another torn down house, right? That's two. Right here, three, okay? Right here, four, another one, five, another one, six, okay? Let's see here. Well... Here's another one. I don't know if that was the other one we already looked at, but let's count that as seven. This motherfucker right here is on its way. We'll count that as seven and a half, okay? And then you just cruise down here. Look, we got some more, okay? Uh, everything's cool right here, but here's another one. Eight, nine. Okay, what was that? Ten, eleven. All right. Here's another one. Twelve. So just from where we were, just to the end of the street, right? We got twelve... Uh, lots where the houses were so dilapidated, it made more sense to just tear them down uh, than fix them up. Usually what happens in these super blighted neighborhoods is uh, people just let the city foreclose on them, okay? The city just forecloses on them due to them not paying the taxes. Then the city just demolishes the property, and then they offer it to investors to buy the lots for a dollar from the land bank, okay? Hey, lenders. Our investors are looking to work with you. Send us an email at sales at holtonwise.com. So that is like your cue, right? If you, you know, you can take my word for it that it's a super dangerous neighborhood and super blighted. Uh, if you check out the Ultimate Guide to Grading Cleveland Neighborhoods, which there, it is linked in the show notes below, uh, I have graded all the neighborhoods on an A to F scale. You'll see I've given this neighborhood an F. I also include the medium household income in there, right? So you guys might want to check that out. Uh, there's some more data to back this up, but obviously Google Earth tells you the picture, right? So the neighborhood, super rough, super tough, super blighted. That's going to lead you to extremely high-risk tenants, right, which is one problem, which is why I can't project out the return for you. And then the bigger problem, problem for you guys is again your labor force because the big legitimate companies we're just not going to deal with it right uh it's just too difficult too low profitability for us to even deal with it affects uh, my retention rate on my management and construction employees so your only option then would be to again hire brand new unproven property managers or unlicensed property managers both of which are an incredibly high risk in my opinion bad idea for two guys living in oregon who are trying to start their real estate business out here in cleveland if you guys were local and uh you had your own like you're, you're here, you're living here, you have your own real estate business where you're doing all the property management construction in-house, you could oversee your business, that might be something else. But you guys just have to rely on way too many unknowns, way better opportunities out there to get started in the Cleveland market other than this one, right? This is just too friggin' high risk, fellas. As a matter of fact, I have another one that I think would be a much better option for you, which we're gonna get into right now. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.